Welcome to another episode of Dad's Rules with Kevin Belzer and special guest, Melissa Belzer. <laughs> Hi. We are in Mesa, Arizona at the Menace Undergrounds, MAF Podcast Studios. Even for those of you watching online, you can see we're wearing, um, or I'm wearing, Menace swag. Yes, yeah. Yep. Wearing some Menace swag, showing some support for the uh, studio. Let me use their location. Now I have to do this in my home office with a dog and a cat bothering me. <laughs> bothering. Yep. Demanding attention. Got a joke for you. Um, okay. All right. <laughs> this is a, a dad joke. Oh, so these is, are the best. These, this is very appropriate. Uh, let's see. Where was it? Okay. What does a house wear? What does a house wear? I don't know. A dress. <laughs> and a dress. A dress. A yep. dress. I know. That's pretty okay. funny. That is a good one. Yep. A dress. I put that in my notes section just so I'd remember to bring it up on an episode. Okay. That was a good one. Yep. I thought so. I've heard some good ones. Well, you know, I'm a real tour. There's not tour. a, there's not, it's not real a tour. Right. Real tour. What was that show? Uh, um, San Clem no. The, oh, oh I know what you're talking about. It's a. It was a Netflix show where they were they were real estate agents, but one of them was like a zombie. Oh, Santa Santa Clarita Diet. Yeah, Santa Clar Clarita. Right. Santa Clarita Diet. Yeah. Yeah. Or whatever. Yeah. She pronounced it real a tour, and yeah, she pronounced she it, it real like... tour because we have an extra syllable because we go the extra mile. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was funny. I was like, like that's uh, yeah, that's not really exactly how it works. But anyway, that was funny. Yeah, I thought it was hilarious. Yeah, that was good. But I have a weird sense of humor. Yeah. We're going to do icebreaker. Ooh. Icebreaker deck brought to you by Best Cell. Still needs to be Best Cell. Best Cell sponsor. <laughs> That'd be great. It's like we're giving him free uh, advertising on here. Okay, so we need to pick color on here. We may only need to do one card. So what do you want to do? We've got gray, yellow, red, blue, dark blue, or green. So you got life, dark random, blue. deep, experiences, if you could, and oh. would you rather. Oh, let's do dark blue. That's would you rather? Mm -hmm. Okay, let, we were talking about that too. Let's, let's give it a shot and see. So we do have some would you rather, so we're good. We have some would you rathers, right, but these are hilarious. Yeah, but, okay. I'm actually surprised. So we did this on a another podcast, and I had somebody get mad at me in the YouTube comments going, both of these are fixable. That's what they said. They go, both of these are fixable. Play the game, man. Play and the so, game. This is a dumb question. Dot, 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 SMH. Shake my head. That's what that smack means. Smack my head. Smack my head. Is this smack my head? Yeah. I thought it was shake my head. I oh, think it's shake my head. I thought it was smack my head. Let's let the people at home decide. I don't know. I thought it was smack my Does head. Does SMH stand for smack my head or shake my head? Oh. Okay, that'll be interesting. Viewers will decide. <laughs> Viewers will. I thought I was smack my head. Okay. Well, I thought it was hilarious, and I want okay. to thank that person for commenting because you helped the algorithms and bumped <laughs> it up several thousand more views by commenting like that. Because I will not take your comment down. Would you rather? It's supposed to be two uncomfortable things, and you're supposed to just pick one. You just play the game. That's all. Would you rather be a stupid poopy head, <laughs> <laughs> or? <laughs> I don't know what even would I don't be. Either. I don't either. <laughs> What's I this card? Would you rather be too hot or too cold? Oh. oh. I know my answer. Would you rather be too hot or too cold? I mean, I would have to say too hot. The final I mean, answer? I don't like to be cold. Cold yeah, is me neither. painful. I hate being cold. I don't like being cold. I've been hot and uncomfortable, but being cold is me is just a whole new level of uncomfortable. We live in Arizona. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was thinking. We like, live in I desert. live here for a reason. Apparently, we haven't found too hot. July doesn't bother me, so mm. it gets hot. Yes. When it gets above one ten, it's a little crazy. Well. So, ooh. what's their definition of too hot? That'd be that'd be a good question. And what's the definition of too cold? Either way, I wouldn't want to be too cold because that's absolutely miserable. Too cold is just worse. I jumped in two pools last week. Oh, gosh. And they... The splash program. See, yeah, for my real estate, the splash program. That's yeah. part of my marketing is I jump in the pools yeah. and... If we you make, have one, yeah. Yeah, we make videos out of it and we have a lot of fun with it. Yeah. Normally. 
<laughs> Normally. Uh, yeah, it rained the night before. In some parts, yeah. it snowed and sleeted or hailed yeah. or whatever. Yeah. So it was like that. really cold. Yeah. By the time I jumped in the pool, it was 49 degrees out. But the pool water had to been... I don't know. It was really cold. I, I don't have a thermometer. I wish we'd... We're going to have to invest in that. Best case scenario, 40. It was cold. No. I don't know. I don't know if I was get praying to cold. baby Jesus by the time I came out of the water. <laughs> I would have to ask friends who've had a pool this time of year, well, what's your temperature? I don't know because we didn't have one. I meant to get... We should get one because I, I do get curious. Well, I did not it like being really in the cold. water. Right. I did not like being in the water. No, you look frozen. The funny thing is, though, when I got out of the water and hit the air, which was, it was 49 degrees out. Yeah. I was actually warm, which ought to tell you how cold the water was. Oh. Or I'd lost all feeling in all of my body. It's one or the other. I think that's typical, though, to feel. Well, I yeah, know, the, the, the first pool was so bad because I went into two pools that day. But the first pool yeah. was so bad that I jumped in with my shades on, lost my shades in the pool. I had to go back had down go, into the cold. I had to go back down the water to get the shades like, and come oh. back up. I'm like, yeah, it was not Should've any more the fun shades. the second time down. Yeah, yeah. banning them. Yeah, yeah, you should, or you should no, no, you should just not warn them. Well, I've done it before without them coming. Yeah, out. but not in that cold of water. So for future, if you have to jump in cold water, you ditch the shades. Don't wear them. So just from that experience alone, I don't want to do too cold. And the funny thing is, on both of them are not really funny. It was sad. Before jumping in either pool that day, I was already cold before I went into the water. Yeah. Yeah, it was pretty chilly. And I don't do it in, like, a Speedo, which I do have custom Speedos with my face on them because one of my fans out there. I know. My fans. Funny. Fans. Yeah. You're one of your no, fans. It's one of my friends. Yes. One of my friends sent um, one of your custom, friends. custom Speedo with my face all over it. It was a Fran. <laughs> yeah, a, a Fran. Friend fan. A Fran. A Fran. A Fran. Like a Fran. Or it could be friend. Okay. Yeah, a Fran. We'll ask the audience again. Friend. That's if you one. combine the word fan and friend, is it Fran or Frand? They aren't even going to care. <laughs> but I do, and I need I to know. It could be. Well, if you take the big... You and how do you know they the won't words? care? You know what I found do. from doing this no, for so long? Right, maybe. 50 some episodes into this. And you know yes. what I found out from doing this? Is that people care about the weirdest shit. Okay. Yeah, maybe. And I'm actually okay with that. <laughs> well, if you take words, you don't, like, combine... You don't plunk one in the middle, usually. You usually take part of one and part of another. So, Fran. But, friend. I could see that working. It's a friend fan. So when ben, a fan uh, friend. ben Affleck and Angelina Jolie, when they were combined, what was their name? Brangelina. Brangelina. Yeah. Ben Affleck and Angelina. Yeah. Yeah. It was, it was Brangelina. Brad. Oh, wait. No, Brad. You said Brad. Brad Pitt? Oh, yeah. Brad Pitt. Yeah, not ben Brangelina. Affleck. Right. Brangelina. Brad Pitt. Yeah, it wasn't Ben Affleck. Yeah, no, Ben Affleck. No, Jim Ben Affleck Garner was, was Jen Benifer. Was what? Benifer. Benifer? I don't know why. What is he with, with? So is he still Benifer now that he's with uh, um, Jennifer I don't know because I haven't heard. I, I don't remember what they're calling. I mean, is he Benifer again? Or is uh, it Benifer with no. like the little two up in the corner? No. Benifer Square. No, they haven't. I don't know. I can't. I'm, I know they have something. I just don't remember what it See, is. See, these are the important things that I think about. <laughs> yeah, since ours doesn't work. What would ours be? Bel something Belissa? weird. Yeah, no, but we've already combined yours, the no, smell bell. No, we, yeah, but no, but that's me. Yeah, but no. We don't have a combo. No. But you have I'm your own. I'm talking about a combo. Right, and I like mine. Mine's like awesome. I still have a few friends that even just call me that besides you, which is cool. I like that. That That is a, na a nickname I have well embraced so since day Me Mevin, one. So Mevin doesn't work. No. Kalissa. No. Yeah, see, we don't work. <laughs> it doesn't work. We don't have a combo name, and that's okay, I guess. Yeah. It's not we're, Our names aren't that cool. If only. <laughs> Maybe if your names don't combine, you have a better chance of working out. I don't know. Well, we're still here. I don't have any plans Look to go Look at all anywhere. the ones that combine their names I mean, and they're not together yeah, anymore. Yeah, there's probably... I think there's something that. to be said about that. I don't know. I have to if we ran the it. stats on it, I would bet the success rate of people that have combined names that actually work has got to be around 27.4%. <laughs> More stats you're just flinging out there. <laughs> yeah. Okay. My that's... stats are mathematically sound until you actually do some math on them. <laughs> like, it's like mine and the cake smashing. I have a theory. I don't know if it's true. What's cake smashing? You know, the one, the weddings where they smash the cake. Oh, smashing cake in your wife's and your spouse, you know, the wife or the husband's face. I, what is up well, with that? Well, especially the wife, but either one, I don't think you should smash And is it pre or post photos? I don't. I don't. I don't think there should be any smashing of cake on your. Either way, day. it's it's wrong altogether. Yeah, we we don't we as we don't like it. I would but. like your opinion on that one as well. So please chime in, comment, let me know. Do you think that couples should be smashing cakes into each other's face when they get married? Yeah, we don't. We don't. Viewers we, decide. Yeah, viewers decide. 
<laughs> More senseless topics to talk about. Smashing cake. <laughs> I think it's an important topic. It, it, I, because every time I see it, I cringe. It's something I think cringe. about because it makes me, it makes me cringe. I'm like, yep, that's a divorce. I would never smash cake in your face. I wouldn't disrespect somebody like no, that. No, not on wedding day. I would do it to like a friend. But your spouse, oh, no. Yeah, well, it's... Your friend, it's a prank. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. Wedding day, it, I think, should be off limits. It should yeah. be a thing. Cause but that's just me. <laughs> pranks can be funny. And if you've done it, great. That's fine. It's just we would never... Nev that would be... We would never No, do if that. you have done it, you're wrong, and you need you owe the other person an apology. <laughs> and I would like it videotaped and sent to me. <laughs> oh, man. Here we go. Why not? We'll I, combine them all as a bunch of reels. It'd I mean, be hilarious. I guess. Um, yeah. On yeah. this week's episode of Dad's Rules, we're going to combine a bunch of reels of people apologizing <laughs> for smashing cakes into their spouse's faces. Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen, but we'll see. I, never, I guess I never know. I can only only hope. That would be great if like, they did a montage one, like they showed it, because you know it was photographed or videoed. Yeah. They show that, and then they show with the sappy music of them apologizing. Oh yeah, tears that streaming down like they got the one the one tear. Oh, do the fake. Yeah. Do the one tear. I'm so sorry. If they truly meant, they get the tattoo of the tear. Oh no, <laughs> no. No, don't 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 do that. Don't do no. that. No. I think that means you killed somebody or something. I don't know. Probably. Yeah, and then you have to live up to that tattoo. See the rabbit hole you go yeah, down to. Now no. you have to go kill somebody no. to no, live up to the tattoo. No, stop. But that's where the tattoo yeah, goes. No, we don't want to oh, go there. Oh, it's awful. No, it's bad. I mean, if you got like a rain, a rainforest of, of tattoos coming down right here, it's like you are busy. Oh man! <laughs> Speaking of rabbit holes, back to the card. Back to the card. <laughs> so, would you rather be too hot or too cold? I think we've already decided. Both of us said too, too hot. hot. Too hot. Yep. I think it's just easier to cool down than it is to heat up. I think so. For me, that's it what is. she said. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. <laughs> Help me. <laughs> All right. Well, I honestly thought we were going to get through more than one card on this one, but we did one Would You Rather and jumped on a giant rabbit hole. Um, okay. Yep. So we're going to end it right there. All right. Like or hate the show, which this one, how could you not love it to the ends of the earth? <laughs> to the ends of the earth. Well, yes. yeah, because there is no end because it goes around and you go back to the beginning. And, yes. Yep. Anywho, <laughs> if you like or hate the show, I need you to share, like, comment, leave reviews, all that fun stuff. Yeah. And by the, you know, for the love of God, for the love of baby Jesus, buy our swag so we can get off the ramen noodle diet. Oh, man. Sad music playing. <laughs> <laughs> Until next time, go out and be the kick-ass adult I know you all can be. <laughs>